Rory Miriam never gets tired of doing the things she loves. But at least, let those things she's planning to do, let there be something that even other people will come in and say, wow, this woman is trying. Don't put anybody in a higher skill. Don't put anybody in positions whereas they can't even help themselves. That will be the most annoying part in all of these things you are doing. That will be the most annoying part because nobody will be willing to save you. Because they will still think, okay, is this not what this guy always do? How will this guy do this? How will this guy do that? Think about it. It's not something you go around and talk about all the time. You have to use your number six. Make it useful sometimes. Make it very useful sometimes. Not every time you will be thinking, thinking, thinking. Are you not tired of thinking? No, wait. Are you not tired of thinking? That is one thing. It's not that you are, you, you are making wrong decisions. You are not. But at least make decisions that will favor everybody. So guys, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, depending on when and where you are actually watching us from. This is Royal Update TV, where we'll bring you top tips from the entertainment industry and also from the Oni of Ife Palace. A whole bunch of things have been occurring in the palace, which has made Oni himself very speechless. Which has made Oni very, very speechless because he cannot understand why all of these Oloris tend to choose this part. Why every one of them will tend to choose this part over all that has been happening. Now we are hearing that Olori Miriam is planning on doing some sacrifices. Only God knows what is happening. Toby Phillips is complaining that yes, it is her own child she wants to use. What, all, what is all of these things that is happening nowadays? Why is it that you will decide over, some, over an animal you can use and you'll be happy? You are going ahead to, you want, you want to use a small, ah, bah, no nah, no nah. At least if you have conscience, have it completely now. Have that your conscience completely. Don't have halfway conscience because that will not help you. Don't have it because that will not help you at all. Because it will get to a point in your life where you have to make decisions. Where you have to be sure about the decisions you make. Whether you think they are right or you think they are wrong. You have to make decisions for yourself to show them that yes, truly, you are worthy. Truly, truly, you are worthy. So anything they want to try and tell you, it should not, be, it should not even bother you. It should not bother you at all. But all of Miriam's own is getting out of hand. Everybody has realized it. All of Miriam's own is getting out of hand. She thinks like she's the only one that knows how all of these things happen. That is what exactly she thinks. If not, eh, she won't be behaving this way. She won't be behaving this way. A whole lot of things have been going on inside of the palace. Yet, they are not complaining. Yet, they are not talking about it. But if you reach Queen Naomi Stone, that is when everybody will be happy. Say, hey, Queen Naomi did this. Queen Naomi is not meant to do that. When you reach Stone, that you are meant to talk. So you'll be happy that you even made a statement. You will not say anything. You will not say anything. No. You will not talk about it. But when you reach Queen Naomi's matter now, that is when you will not open eye. That is when you say, yes, it is true. She did this. She did that. When you are meant to say it before, you did not say it. But when, she's, when she comes in and reveals one person truth, or one person, you say, yes, you will knew, but you are doing this. What are you doing? What exactly are you doing? You are doing nothing to favor anybody. All of the things you are doing right now is to favor yourself. Not even a single person. Not even a single person in thought. You are just doing all of it to help yourself. And that is true. You should help yourself in any manner you can think of. But do it well. Do it well. That is one thing that will help you. Once you start to take your matter seriously, people will take you seriously as well. People are going to take you seriously. People you do not even think about. People you do not even picture in your head that they will take you serious. That is the people that will take you serious. If Olori Miriam continues with all this her act, I'm not sure whether she's going to lead anywhere. I am not sure whether she's going to go far. This is no this is no swear or something, but with the way you have seen Olori Miriam, going far will be very, very hard for her. Because she will have to deal with and cope with all of these things that is happening. She will have to continue doing all of this. And it will get to a point then eh, people will now complain that yes, this woman has done too much already. We don't want her again. That is when problem will start. That is where problem will start. 
Because when problem starts like that, then hey, that is you when you realize who is with you and who is against you. And right now, Olori Miriam does not even understand who is with her and who is against her. So what is the use for all of these things she's doing? There is no use at all. She thinks everything just comes as it goes. That is not how life works. If you are doing good for somebody, do good completely. Don't do it halfway, leave it halfway. It is not, it is not right. It is not right at all. Try and make it as good as possible for yourself. And also for the people around you because they too, they are hoping to make sure everything works out for them. Not only you, that they are planning all of this. You are not the only one planning all of it. You have people that are here to make sure that even you see what is happening. Not that they will try to help you, you think it's an insult. You say, hey, how would this one help me? See this small person, see this person, see that. That is when you now realize, when you realize all these things, eh, that is when you come to your sense, you say, ah, all of these things I've done, they are bad, do. how can I do, do to, to stop all of this? That, when, you, when you now think of that, eh, that is this stage, eh, it's, called, it, it's called somewhere you can't go back. You can't go back and change that your decision you made because you have made it. So in decision making, eh, Olori Miriam should be fast about it. She should be clear with her intentions. She not even think twice about it because she does. That is when problem will start for her. So guys, don't forget to like, share and subscribe and don't forget to drop your comments.